to my channel, Miss Naturally Mary here. If you are new, be sure to subscribe by the end. I have another winner for you all. Today we're gonna be trying a Boss Babe Curly Pixie haircut. And y'all, it's a wig. I know it looks so realistic and natural from the thumbnail. It actually blew me away how natural it looked and how well it turned out. But y'all, it's so beautiful. This is the construction that I got mine in. It is a 13 by four, but this unit also comes in a four by four and you can get it even less expensive if you go with the four by four. So I'm gonna try it on and see if it actually fits me. I was a little nervous by the size of this one. I can't remember what size I got, but it seemed to be a little small when I initially put it on. And I was like, man, am I even gonna be able to install this and it look good? But I was like, okay, get it together, Mary, you got this. So I began by putting it on my mannequin head because I do wanna show you guys what it looks like up close. I wanna show you all this pre-plugged hairline, how nice they styled it y'all I love the shape of this one they tapered it just perfectly in the back the curls are really beautiful and y'all it looks so real wigs have truly come a long way this one is in lint six this is actually the shortest curly texture unit that I've ever worn it has a really nice pre-plugged hairline they've also lightly bleached the knots right now I'm just turning over the lace so that I can tint it I'll be using the Ruby kiss 3d face creator in order to tint the lace I use this all the time so so I'm just gonna do this and then after doing so I'm gonna cut the lace off in the front and then I'll come back on when it's time to install. So after cutting the lace off and putting the unit back on, I was pleasantly surprised to see that it actually did fit much better. This unit isn't necessarily big head friendly. I would say size up. I could have actually used a larger size, but I made it work. So right now I'm preparing for the install. I'm gonna apply some gel to the back of my nape area because I don't want the BDBs to be poking out, especially with the curlier texture unit. My hair is on the kinky curly side, so my hair wouldn't necessarily blend with a silkier curly texture like this. So I'm slicking my edges down and then after doing so, I'm gonna begin to use a clip just to make sure that the lace is out of my way while I apply my gel. So I'm gonna be using the Got To Be Glue in the yellow bottle in order to secure this unit down and melt the lace and all. So I'm just putting it on my hairline, but if you do not have a low hairline, this would actually be your skin, so you wouldn't have to worry about any gel on your edges or anything. But after doing this, you just begin to lay the lace down and you're gonna use your comb in order to manipulate the hair along the lace in order to melt it and to get it looking really nice and laid the way that you like it. So I'm gonna allow you all to watch this process. Pretty soon I'm gonna grab my mousse and I'm gonna begin molding the hairline. But in the beginning stages, I'm pretty much just working to lay down the lace at this point. Wake up in the morning, talk to God what he say. Blessing, blessing, blessings coming my way and I say thank you. Oh, thank you. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I think I guess I'm blessed. I don't even need that stress. Look, shorty on my arm breaking next. Probably cause she know I'm breaking next. Uh never ever say I can't. Cause I walk with an S on my chest. I don't chase nothing but a check. Everybody got a little jet. I'm not sure if you all noticed, but I only laid down the right side and the center. It wasn't necessary for me to lay down the left side, so that'll save you some time. After doing that, I just put on a scarf, allowed it to set for about five to 10 minutes, and now I'm gonna begin manipulating it, parting it off where I desire the part to be, and then also adding mousse. I also decided to add some baby hair because I do have a low hairline, so I wanna cover my hairline as much as possible, but it's not necessary to have baby hair if you don't desire that. What? I'm trying to be completely debt free I know people that's so upset that I don't have a plan B And I do this for my dogs, my girl, and all the family And if you've been where I've been, you will understand me You understand Praying that my wings won't fail me now Hoping that my feet won't touch the ground
addition to applying mousse, I also decided to use my Felicia Leatherwood brush in order to define the curls. This is really gonna help to plump the curls and make them look so juicy. Baby, 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 baby. You're driving me wild, you're driving me so crazy. Got me acting out, got me trying to stay sober. Got me trying to stay sober. Wanted to your love and I'm out here hungover. You made me want to take you to London, Paris. Thanks, so. Times were cherished. No comparing to you. looks so fly y'all I just love it now I'm gonna show you all a different way that you can wear it where it's more so like a finger wave type look it's kind of more sleek and it kind of has like that wet look to it so I'm gonna do that now I'm gonna flatten it out kind of try to do some finger waves it didn't quite work out but it still looked good in the end but I'm gonna let you guys watch that and then later I'm gonna add a headband it's gonna be so cute with that as well Stuck in a pretty bad world. Uh -huh. Oh, you got the nerve wearing that skirt up and grabbing your girls. Uh -huh. If you ask me, oh. you got that trip chocolate factory. Yeah. All of these chicks coming at me, oh. but none of these girls. Y'all, I really didn't know what I was in for trying this wig, but I'm so happy that I did. If you are someone who's looking to cut your hair or maybe do the big chop, I'd say try a really short wig first so that you can kind of get used to and get a feel for how you're going to look with short hair. See if it's something you actually want to do. And this one is so realistic. It's going to look like your natural hair anyway. So that's a nice plus. But you all let me know what you all think about this short pixie haircut. It's so easy to style. Short hair is also so easy to maintain and it's so stylish and sassy. And I just love the way it looks with the hairband. This is actually how I wore my hair when I big chopped. I would always put a little hairband in the front it looks so cute like that i look forward to your comments and feedback be sure to like this video also comment and subscribe and check the description box for all the links and specifications for this unit i do have a discount code for you guys also follow me on instagram if you aren't already i love you guys and i'll see you all in my next video bye guys Girl, you know you